My Xbox Live billing account has been locked. That's a heck of a way to break your Xbox One gaming addiction. I didn't do it. And I don't know what to do about it. If you just downloaded membership, you could get the notice it has been locked for a couple of hours. I've had this account for ages. If you use prepaid cards to pay for the account and one of those transactions is cancelled or didn't go through, the account is locked until the issue is resolved. I used a mix of prepaid cards and credit cards for the past year to pay for my account. If you used a credit card to pay for merchandise or the account fees and you literally hit your limit, the account will get locked. That's a different reason to use the prepaid card. I've heard of the error happening if the billing address for the credit card doesn't match the one for Xbox. That's a security measure. And if you entered your zip code wrong or had a typo in the information, it can come back as invalid. None of that information has changed for ages. If the account is locked and you get status code 80169D94, the problem is usually incomplete billing information like lacking a full name or missing address information. I can't imagine them requiring more information, and again, nothing's changed except the Xbox error messages. The billing information is void if the credit card you use has expired. And then when they try to bill you, the transaction bounces and the account is locked. The billing information is void if the credit card you use has expired. And then when they try to bill you, the transaction bounces and the account is locked. I use the credit card for other things. I hope no one else is using your credit card for other things. And if they are using your account to log in and buy things on other systems, that could explain the account lock. If I'm the victim of identity theft, my Xbox being locked is the least of my concerns. It could be something far simpler like an error during the transaction when you tried to enter your last prepaid card info. That usually requires entering the information again once the system has cleared, though you may need to log out and reboot the Xbox to get it to work. Try changing your Xbox Live account billing address and make sure it matches the billing address of the credit card company. I'd hate to think their information is messed up because that's the only way I can think it is not right. If your phone number under billing information is old and you've gotten a new one since, you can get the account locked notice because you don't have a working number. That's something I can fix by updating the billing and account information. Then again. The error can occur if you're in the process of paying and downloading something and Xbox Live service goes down. I can't help it if their servers go down. At least you can check to see if their servers are down before you freak out. But if all the account info is right, you have to contact them for service.